was murdered with an unknown chemical and then violently stabbed to death. I'm determined to find out who did this. Good day. Yeah. You know what? Mm -hmm. um, were you aware that Mrs. White was recently murdered? Yeah, I was. And what was your opinion of Mrs. White? Well, to be honest, I worked with her in a lab. She was one of my teachers, and she was completely filthy. What do you mean? Look at this rash that she gave me. With my chemicals I was working with, sodium chloride and... Got all and over she, my the skin. night that she was murdered, <clears throat> March 18th, were you not in possession of a chemical in your glove compartment? I was on my way to a casting call, and yes, I was. There was 0.05 to 0.15 molarity of calcium chloride in my glove compartment. Because I was working on a lab, and I needed to transport mm -hmm. it to another lab. Okay, and Mrs. White was killed, so you're saying you did not have any sodium carbonate in your possession? Um, no. Good out. murdered on March 18th by someone with sodium carbonate. Have you had any of that chemical in your possession lately? No, I haven't. I'm pretty sure that you have. Um, actually I haven't. And I was in the lab 24-7 hours a day working on my lab reports and my Texas's and my tests because I didn't want to do them in class anymore. And Mrs. White made me make them all up. So you didn't have any resent to her or bad intentions to harm her because of her not helping you in chemistry? No, she was just really ugly. Well, we're going to be investigating your house and the rest of this room, so if we find any sodium carbonate, just know that it's going to be a worse penalty than if you confess now. Um, okay. Okay, we'll be investigating and I'll stay in touch. Where you going? sunset on my boat. Were you aware that that night Mrs. White was brutally murdered? I am aware of that. And I'm pretty sure that we found some sodium carbonate on your boat. Do you have any um, alibi for that? Because Mrs. White was killed with 0.74 molarity of sodium carbonate. Yes, I believe my sample of sodium carbonate was 0.2 to 0.3 molarity, so I'm innocent. Do you have any idea who might have done this? The is that it was Miss Peacock who killed her. Alright, I'll look into that later. <laughs> I'm here to search your house. I have a search warrant. Well, I'm looking for sodium carbonate. Um, I don't have any. Are you sure about that? You're um, telling me if I look around here, I'm not going to find anything? I don't think so. I I mean, unless someone's trying to frame What's me. Oh my this? God! I don't know! Is this sodium carbonate? It says right here that it's sodium carbonate. I, someone must have put it there. I didn't do I'm it. I'm going to take this to the lab. And once I find out what the molarity is, you could be arrested for the killing of Mrs. White. I don't even know. Oh. Sodium carbonate that we found in Mrs. Peacock's room to the lab. We tested the molarity by dividing the amount, which was 0 0.015 liters, by 0 0.011 moles, which was the amount of moles of sodium carbonate. And we found out that the molarity was 0.74 matching exactly the molarity that Mrs. White was killed with. That way we know that Mrs. Peacock is the murderer. Oh, Mrs. Peacock, I took that sodium carbonate to the lab and it has the exact molarity that Mrs. White was killed with. You're going downtown.